from Philippines Lazada and today's episode we're gonna teach you how to use this modem this is the latest globe packet Wi-Fi modem and the predecessor modem is this one and this is the new one this is model E5576 as you could see here at the back okay and this is the latest 2020 model and the other one Okay, this is E5573CS933, which is a very good unit. We have this at our shop at Lazada, Philippines. Now, the link is on the description, video description down below. Just click the down arrow so you could see and click the link. Now, at the time of filming this video, this is at 1,295 pesos. It has a free 5 GB load for seven days. Just you need just need to text free 10 5 GB. Okay, let's focus on that free 5 GB to 8080. There is a text interface inside the modem itself. So we're gonna see how to access that. And in this video, before we proceed. We're gonna unbox this, gonna see the parts, gonna see the features, and then, of course, how to use this, the basics on how to turn this on, how to turn this off, how to charge this, how to read the signals, and how to reset this. And also, we're gonna claim the 5G reload. So, let's, go, let's get going and break the seal here, the bottom, and then, Okay, as we are unboxing this, we're gonna put all the contents of the package here. And this is the modem itself, okay? This is the E5576 modem. This is a, an original from Huawei. And this is its battery. The charging cable, data cable, you can use this to charge and transmit data to your laptop. And then this is a one year warranty card from Huawei, which is which can be claimed at any globe center. And this is a quick start. Basically, what I'm saying right now is all here, and of course, the sim. Okay, the sim is a regular tricat 4g lte sim but it has a free 5gb for seven days so it's very basic just text this to 8080 you could also use the sim to your cell phone text that and then insert that here to your modem so you could claim the load now let's turn on the unit before we turn on the unit we're gonna have to prepare the battery Battery is 1,500 mAh, okay, milliamperes, and it could last you four to six hours of continuous usage. Also, the standby time is more than 24 hours, 24 to 36 hours. And next, we're gonna also, okay, sometimes this unit. Uh, is closed when it arrives to your home and then you you need you just need to open that by finding the notch okay there's a corner here where there is a notch okay this is the corner i'm telling you and then you slide your thing your thumb uh, nail on it and then just prick it out so you could release the cover and just open this your sim we have opened this already your number this is you need to know this because this is the one you're gonna be using to load your modem so just prefix a zero just before the nine and then give that to any load retailers 
and the seam is here go we're gonna insert that there's a correct position the chip is going to those um six okay you could see that okay six gold plated pins and the correct position is like that there's a slotted portion here which needs to be positioned correctly so just slide the seam inside and then that's the correct one okay and before we close this we need to discuss the parts first okay this is the signal indicator this could be red green or yellow green is okay yellow is weak and red is no signal or no internet this is your battery indicator this could be green and this could be red red means low battery and you need to charge that and at the back we're gonna have to this is your char this is your battery pin this is where the battery goes in so this is the actual connection and that's the correct position on how to put your battery to your modem and of course the details are here you could see that the, there's the model this is your dashboard okay this is your modem settings you're gonna open this in Chrome or any web browser and uh, password is admin and this is important by the way SSID is your Wi-Fi name the, this is the one you will need to connect to using the Wi-Fi key this is a Wi-Fi password this is all caps okay all capital letters and you need to enter that in your Wi-Fi on your phone or your tablet or your laptop now just insert the battery inside and then the on button is here over here you just need to press that until the lights turn on and at the bottom there is your micro USB port this is where you need to connect your charger cable and how to charge this you can charge this using your cell phone charger could you charge this using your um, your this is a Romos power bank and when you insert that and turn on the modem it starts to blink so the battery indicator starts to blink and that means that it is charging your modem and next thing so we are connected with the green light as i've said earlier if this is red just reinsert the battery just fix the battery position and you're good to go next one we will we'll just close this a bit so okay and now we're ready to connect so in order to connect we don't have load yet we need to claim the load using our cell phone for example this phone this is an old star mobile phone for, for demo purposes okay we're just going to find out what's name it's Huawei 2163 as we have seen earlier and just connect that so the password I've written that already to make this video short all caps okay then just press connect connecting authenticating if you have correctly entered your password the connected word will come up and go to your browser internet browser in this case we just have to go to a usual browser and it redirects to the already to the 192.168.8 so that's your you just need to enter this okay enter this on your browser so that you will arrive at this screen this is your mobile wi-fi screen and let's see what it has for us enter your password as the modem says at the back the password is admin okay the uh, password is inside here and just uh, just enter admin 
small letter admin then press login so there are features here you need to enable auto update I'm not a fan of that so I'll just update it manually and then this set your Wi-Fi name and password so this is a good time to change your Wi-Fi password but just to make this video short and sweet we're just gonna have to skip that by pressing next and then you have here is uh, set router login password so the admin this is talking about the modem dashboard password the password is admin and you could change that also later on in the settings so we're gonna we're not gonna use or change this and we're just gonna have to click finish in order for us to Okay, it doesn't want us to move on, so we're just gonna have to set, uh, click the same as Wi-Fi password to make things safer. Okay, this is our Wi-Fi password. It, it has written password for us. Okay, and that's clever, but it's hard to put in sometimes to other devices. So better watch that out. So your set your password right now is different. Your dashboard password or the modem settings is now different from admin. The password now is just the same as your Wi-Fi password. Okay, so this is the interface. We have here the home and you can see that it is connected. Okay, there are checks. Okay, and my device, and then one device connected. This is the device connected. And the speed of this modem can be up to 42 Mbps, but the modem itself is capable up to 150 Mbps. Globe just, just declared that it is 42 Mbps just to comply with the new rules of the NTC to declare its maximum capability. But the modem is so powerful, it's just the network that is lacking in good service signal strength and speed. Now you have here is your network settings. These are your settings, APN settings, uh, etc. You could mess with it. No worries because anytime you could uh, change reset this by pressing the reset button on the back of your modem I will teach that later on and then we have here is the Wi-Fi settings Wi-Fi settings as I said earlier is the Wi-Fi name security and the password this is the usual important one the password if you want to change your password to another one just change this and then hit save next you also have the power to see the devices which are connected. Okay, the MAC address of this connection. This is the uh, Android something. This is the white, our white phone. And it is connected with the um, MAC address, etc. So, and then next are the tools. Okay, tools. So tools, online devices. So tools, uh, this is the SMS or the text. This is where you could claim your 5GB load. So how, how your device is connecting to a regular browser will apply because you're not registered to a Surf, okay, that's clever from Globe, and then we're just gonna have to claim the 5 GB load by adding plus or the new message, and then let's 
see. This is your number, so 8080 is the number to send the message. And then at the body, you need to enter pre five five GB without space and then click the, this arrow button this is the send button okay and it is sent okay success and now you have a 5GB load and the last thing we're gonna tackle is about resetting the modem why do you need to reset this when you happen to forget the, your password, Wi-Fi password? Or there are problems in connection, you could not connect, or the modem cannot connect to the network. Okay, so the resetting this is probably the best option you'll have. Now, how to reset this? Just open the back cover, or turn on first, of course, the modem. Okay, this is turned on already. Just remove the cover and there is a secret button here or not so secret because there's a reset word written there and the button is here you just need to press this for three to five seconds and observe the light that it will blink and once uh, that blinks that means that the modem is resetting all settings will go back to its default meaning the password will be just the same as this and also all the settings are defaulted so if you mess up with the settings you don't have to worry about anything that you couldn't get it back as working so that's a very handy feature of this modem i like this modem and i hope you like the, this too so with that i'm just gonna give you this modem you could acquire this at our shop lazada philippines ship from philippines lazada and we're gonna throw in this wonderful protector wiper and also a pouch once you close this and if you're a student or you're working you need to you need to protect your modem from scratches of your keys of something sharp coins etc this is a good protection the same time this is a pouch so you don't end up holding your modem all the time you just need to put that there and then this is very fashionable at the same time and this is a freebie of our store ship from philippines lazada the link to the product item is down below the video description just click the down button and there is a link there just follow that and then we're gonna have to talk to you there okay thank you very much this is Jake of Ship from Philippines Tasada. See you online.